So moving on to 1998 and Halloween H20, because although you don't have an official writing credit on this film, I know you were very much involved. Can you kind of tell us when you were brought into H20? And then also as a major Halloween fan, how did you feel about getting to write a Halloween film? Oh, well, I'm glad that I look back and I'm thinking out of all the things, I'm glad I got to have, I got to participate in writing a, a Halloween film. There were other writers that um, wrote a screenplay. They had started pre-production and, you know, Dimension had just decided that they wanted me to write it. They wanted me to rewrite it. And Steve Miner, I'd already worked with because he did the pilot of Dawson's Creek and we had a relationship and he called me and said, can will you please do it? And I was like, no, I don't. Um, I can't. And um, and then, you know, he did he did the thing, the move that he knew would work to get me to do it as he had, he had Jamie Lee Curtis call me. Oh, my God. Were you like, oh, my God, Lori Strode. You don't say no to Jamie Lee Curtis. And I had already met her when I was down in Wilmington doing um, Dawson's Creek because Steve was doing Dawson's Creek. And he, he said, you know, Jamie Lee Curtis is here. And I'm like, where? Where? He's, well, she's right over there shooting. Um, what was Iris? That? No, about on the ship with the monsters on the ship. The, is, that is that virus? virus? Is that virus? Yeah. Virus, the, yes, virus. Yes, yes, the one she yeah. hates. The one she hates. Oh, is that? Well, yeah, I with Billy Baldwin or someone. Yeah. Yes. Okay, so yeah, she was filming that, and so and I have a still so sitting here the, my photo of her from that day. Um, I have it somewhere, and that's when I met her for the first time, and and uh, then you know we worked together a few moments later after that. A little the next year, I guess. We so were then, doing Halloween. I was brought in. They had shot a week. They had oh. shot the opening scene, you know, where the um the nurse comes home mm -hmm. and and then the hockey stick, the guy with the hockey stick. Who was that? I forget who that actor was. Uh, 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 Five hundred days of summer. It's uh yes. oh, oh yes, my yes. god, what's his name? I uh, he was on Third Rock from the Sun. Yeah. Oh my god. Yes. Why am I? I have watching? not had enough coffee. I'm sorry. <laughs> I, 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 I would know the answer. Know that. Yeah. And so anyway, they had filmed that sequence and then they had stopped. They shut down. And and then that's when they called me and brought me in and I talked to uh, Jamie and Steve and Minor and we just started discussing what, you know, where the script was at, what it perhaps where they wanted to take it, what it needed. You know, um, Jamie wanted to uh, see, see, should I get my mother to be in this movie if we write a scene for her? So she pitched me that scene. I love it. That, that I kind of just wrote that she had came up with. And um, and then I wrote it. I took a week to write it. And I kind of kept some stuff, but and then just rearranged things and and um, added like uh, the LL Cool J character was sort of thing underdeveloped. I brought him forward, and and you know just tried to give people fun things to do. And I wanted to bring you know I had such a it's such a I I just remember I want to this is my love letter to John Carpenter. This is going to be my love letter to the franchise where I can say, dear Halloween, I love you so much. I hope you like this. <laughs> that was that was kind of the the goal. And, um, and so Steve was really great with me and he let me, and let me be a part of it and walk around the set. And sort of, we created all those scary sequences. I mean, that is so amazing because as someone, as you know, Halloween is my favorite horror movie and like, I